Hello everybody and welcome to another video of mine where something always goes wrong and what has gone wrong today. Well, we're on Road America Season 4 and it's not going well for me at the moment. Every race I have been crashed into. Um, one guy says you moan every race. Cause I, I, I do talk on them and I, I do moan. Kind of, I'm like, come on guys, what the hell's going on? You don't, don't be risky, don't be stupid. It's always within the first two laps. Um, a lot of people don't understand these cars. A lot of people don't understand racing. I'm gonna under I'm gonna show you something here. Uh, I want you to watch this orange car. Now, this guy has a bit of an appalling start, but I want you to watch. Uh, yeah, right. So this guy here in the blue, he has a bit of a slow start, which is fine. This guy here, just watch him. This orange car, watch him. So I'm gonna press play here. And this has happened to me, not this exact accident, but every race so far, someone's hit me in the side or the back. So I go to draft him, and I see he's moving to the side, I'm like, whoa, whoa, no way. So I move back over to the left, if I'm not getting involved in that, that's always going to have an accident. And there it goes. Nothing I could do. Completely damaged. It's over. Um... He, he then causes more ruckus down the road. Uh, takes six of us out in total. Um, car's gone. I'm just like, enough's enough. That's bad. I mean, that guy's obviously had an appalling start as well. Um, what what could have happened or, or changed? Um, how could I have avoided that? There's not much I could have done. No no race driver would be able to avoid that. Uh, unfortunately, he turns sideways and pummets that way. There, it was a T-bone. Um... So let's look at the chopper view. I go behind her. I'm like, oh, no way are you doing that. I move out the way. I'm like, that's, that's, that's stupid. That was always going to be stupid. Boom. Boom. There's nothing I could do. I couldn't control the car. It's game over there. Absolute game over. Um, how could I have sorted that out? You know, maybe... Slowed down a bit. I don't know. Look at that. It just it's magnetized to me. And stuff like this is happening every race. Anyone who watches this, please, lap one, lap two. It, it's not designed. You know, you, you're not gonna be the world's greatest Formula One driver. All right, it, it's near on impossible. You, you, you know, these people are paid and they drive consistently they know what they're doing lap one and up two is warming up your tires there's this you know if you're good enough the guy in front of you you'll pass him eventually you know you don't need to be in first place within the first 10 seconds honestly you don't and this orange guy i truly believe it's his fault because he can see this guy here's racing so he can see this line here this 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 was always going to be an accident the minute you go free wide on any road race, you know it's going to be an accident. I just wish I'd slowed down just a little bit more. I'd have probably just lost the front end of my car. Even if I slowed down, look, that would have still have hit me in the side. <coughs> Bless your feet. That second one coming. Right. So, yeah. Uh, ruined another race of mine. I would show the others, but it's just pointless. Doesn't the map look like a um, strong man trying to do like a big muscly move? Um, but yeah. Let me, guys, let me know what you guys think. Do you think who was in the fault here? One, two, or three? Or even me, actually. One, two, three, or four. Who was at fault out of all these four cars? You know, um, give a chase view. So if we go back here from the start line, bit of a chase view. Who do you blame? Should the orange car have feathered? I believe so. I'm not interested in overtaking at the first lap. No way. You know, if it happens, it happens. But I'm not there to do stuff like this. That poor green car, who is he? I feel so bad for him as well. Oh, it's Jay. Oh, bless him. You know, there's no need for it. 
And then he goes up here. Look, absolutely perfectly fine at the minute, but he does lose control again up the road somewhere. I'll quickly follow. There he is again. He's such a bad driver. And takes out everybody else. Do you know what I mean? It's... Who do you guys think is at fault? That's the question now. Who do you guys think is at fault? Because I'm, I'm witch hunting him at the moment. I shouldn't be. Let me guys know what you think. I'm, I'm everywhere. Thanks, guys.